Hey, what's going on everybody? My name is The Moist Milkman, and welcome back to another Team Fortress 2 gameplay commentary. Um, so today, let's just dive right into it. Um, I am going to be using the Spy loadout, and it's, it's really funny watching this gameplay, actually. This is the first time I've ever used the Spy, and as you can see right here, I'm not very good at it, but I do tend to try and, um... You know, stick with it, and I'll I'll try to come out on top. Um, I actually really did enjoy playing as a spy. Went in a couple games after, and um, ended up, uh, you know, getting okay. But I think I need to find that uh, one, one thing um, that'll help out a lot. That oh, my jaw just popped. That kind of hurt. Um, the uh, the Deathbringer. Um, that's the other watch. I'm using. I think everything's stock right now, so that's no bueno. But uh, yeah, you can see, I just got that double kill, and you know, it's so fulfilling getting that double kill, or just getting a kill from behind. The stealth and the skill that you have when you play it is really, really fun, and um, I'm probably going to try playing Sniper next, so that should be fun. I have a bow, so it, it should be a really, really fun, fun thing right there. And here I was kind of just screwed, I don't really know or where I was going or what the point of my excursion was to the depths of their homeland and I really did think I was gonna get away right here put on that cloak but apparently you can see somebody that's invisible when they're covered in water or that juicy substance that I seem to be covered in um, also you also notice that um, I did change my field of view it is at I believe 90 now um, which is the highest it can be um, which is awesome it's it's nice to be at 90 um, so I just had to do a couple console commands, so that was really weird, and that is the reason why it took for days to figure out why. And then here I body blocked him on accident, and so that kind of messed that up, and it's just not an all-around good time. But I will come back, and I do, I, I believe we end up winning this game, I'm actually 100% sure, and, um, I thought I, I was gonna douse the fire naturally, but, uh, needed some scout to do with some milk and pour that on me. But the uh, funny thing about this commentary was, I recorded it once already, and it was a pretty dang good commentary. Um, and I recorded it last night, um, and then I put it in Adobe Audition, and we're all good. But then I I do all the edits I do on the voices, you know, add some de the bass, you know, to give me that low, sulky sound that uh, everybody likes. And then I did some other stuff to it, um, you know... Just, you know, making the basic edits to the voices. And it ended up... I closed out of it, and then I, I, I go to look at Enter It In, Sony Vegas, and it's not there. And I'm like, what? And then I'm like, oh, true, I didn't even save it. And so I'm like, okay, probably should just Google how to get this back. And apparently, Adobe Audition does not take temporary files. Um, it doesn't keep track of them. Which I think is weird, and it should all have them. I'm pretty sure Microsoft Word has that ability. Which is very nice, and I'm not sure that that guy didn't see me, but I think he ends up killing me. Nope, I I I got that got that runaway swag, but uh, yeah, he I I don't know, it was just weird. And so you're getting this a day late, uh, but not a dollar short because I do believe that I can I can entertain you guys. And oh man, I love this getting those backstabs. It's just so awesome entertaining you guys and variety of ways um, that's what I like about my skill set is it's not destined to one thing like I could probably post some Call of Duty and you guys would be like oh cool I could post some Smite and you guys would be oh, oh cool I could post some Team Fortress 2 and you guys would be like rad and then I could post some I don't know maybe some Battlefield 3 and you guys would be like cool okay anyways I found out my computer talk um, a while back uh, or last video I asked and I found out that my computer is running on a 350 watt power supply which if you didn't know was not sustainable for the Nvidia GT 670 um, graphics card so I'm gonna have to update my um, what's it called power supply as well as my graphics card so it's gonna take a little bit longer than expected to actually upgrade the graphics card because Indirectly, I need other things as well as that, which I hope my motherboard supports it, because if not, I'm pretty much replacing my entire computer except for my processor and my RAM, which I both think are pretty good. It's an i7 um, and, you know, 20 and 16 gigabytes of RAM. I think I'm good in that area, but uh, yeah. So anyways, guys, this is the last life right here. I'm skipping around because I end up dying and then the 20 seconds and then it just looks weird. 
And right here I figure out that you could have unlimited without the Deathbringer, the uh, unlimited cloak. And, you know, that that's that's all good and stuff. So hopefully I'll get the Deathbringer pretty soon. I'm actually really looking forward to finding that or buying that or something. Um, and yeah, so that that's, that's something I'm looking forward to. I know, wow, what a noob, I know, right? But, uh... Hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, be sure to please leave a like rating as it does help my channel grow. We are almost at a thousand subs, which is really amazing. Um, and something I never dreamed of reaching so fast. So I just want to thank you guys so much for all the support. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks. Bye.